Well then, the Grand Tour game, Amazon game, Prime video, it's, it's finally actually here, it's out tomorrow, but I got it early, thanks. I made a video about the Grand Tour game, talking about what the heck it actually is. Well, today, we've actually got the chance to play it, which is fantastic. The team behind the game actually reached out to me and have allowed me early access to it, which is fantastic, and I've actually got some codes to give away, so if you want to follow me on Twitter, I'll be giving them away there and some in the comments. I'll pick some on here too. Keep your eye on your messages. Single player, season one, season two, season three. Let's jump in with season one and play. We've got the Holy Trinity, which is definitely the best way to start. Scene select. This is interesting. It tells you where it's set. United States, Portugal, United Kingdom. Is it actually going to show some of the episode? Because if so, I probably won't be able to show it. Uh... I don't remember this. Maybe I do. I think... Yeah, I think this is the introduction to the, the Grand Tour. I remember now. It's, it feels like it's been ages since the Grand Tour started, but it, it hasn't at the same time. There you go, at the beginning. All right, let's skip this. Get a bloody <laughs> so when you fast forward, you get Clarkson and then James May is the reversing. And here we are into video game graphics. And we got a message from Mr. Willman. You know what? <laughs> More horsepowers. You know, it actually doesn't look that bad. We've got some great music introduction. First position, I'm racing against Hammond and May, playing as Clarkson. Isn't this weird? Yes, it's very weird. It feels like payback. <laughs> it feels like I'm jumping into payback. They've passed me. Mate, that's rubber banding. I don't know what it is. And this is actually, it seems like, this is, I say point to point opposed to uh, a circuit race that I thought it was. I thought it was all going to be circuit racing, but we got the introduction, which is pretty sweet. Wait, the road's disappeared. Oh, and there we go. Oh, second place. You know what? I did pretty well there, so I'm surprised. And that's the introduction where they had all the cars driving across. That's awesome. I didn't expect this. Over the next 12 weeks, it's already, it's already, it's already happened. Oh, okay, here we go. Now we're moving on to the meat and potatoes. This is a McLaren P1, jumping straight into it. Mr. Will, we get to the truck. I'm, god damn it, it's okay. So I'm racing Hammond to the to the track. The handling is weird. It's not, it's very, it's, de it's definitely arcadey. It's definitely arcadey, but it, it's gripping. I'm not just drifting everywhere. The big need for speed already, it's already better than need for speed. Move, boy. Excuse me. I don't think there's another camera angle. I've been att attempting to change it, but I've pressed every button and I can't change it. So as I said, this game is what? Like £12, which is probably like $15. Which is probably not a lot of money. I'm doing my best to drive carefully, Clark. So passing! Passing! Ha-ha! The P1! Ah, the, oh, the Germans are back. The sounds are good. The car models are great. The environments are pretty decent too. Again, for this price of game. 170 miles. There we go. To the next race. The oh, we're going to the actual track now. So again, this is basically playing through the episodes. I'm interested to see because obviously, have they done all of the season one or two? I'm not too sure. Uh, but what'd be interesting is to see if season three is going to be more of the exploration stuff, like I think it's going to be. We're now ready for the main event. So they, it's it's weird. I mean. It almost feels like this is what Amazon would love to do with... I'm actually driving the 918 now. Oh, we got the handbrake button as well. They're taking audio clips from the actual episodes. Wait, we've got a drift... Oh, no! Craig! Drifting! He's done it again. He's done it a bum again. He's got, he's got drifting in a game. Can you believe it? He moved to Amazon. But this makes me think that Amazon could... Imagine one day when streaming becomes a big thing. Where... You finish the episode and you're like, okay, I want to now play that episode. You don't need a console. You just pick up the control, press the button, and boom, you're playing that exact episode you were just watching. I think that's the idea. That's one day what you'll be able to do because, uh... oh, we're actually supposed to be drifting here. I didn't even realize. Uh, yeah, I've got no chance of doing that now. I didn't realize. I was doing some race. I was trying not to drift. This is brilliant. It's now time. For the P1! The P1 is definitely the one I would go for. Of the hyper cars, there's just something about it. It's just crazy. I take this over a center. 
I definitely would. The transition into game. I've got no time to read what Mr. Wilman's saying. Get off my screen, Wilman. Wait, what have I actually got to do? I'm not drifting the P1. The P1's better at drifting. Oh, yes. Have I ever got a scare Hammond? I think I've got a scare Hammond. That's my objective. <laughs> I've got no scared Hammond so far. Fear makes it funnier. Was that, sc was that not scary, Hammond? Wait, so if I s time zero, I win? I'm not exactly sure what the objective is. To get no scared Hammonds. So I guess it's not to crash, it's just to put on a brutal drive. I'm glad it's not just race, 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 race. I much prefer the, the different styles, the game modes is definitely what I like to see in games. We haven't got customized, can we put a big one on the P1 on the Grand Target? I don't think so. <laughs> I do remember this. Well, this is rubbish. <laughs> I have in the back of that lorry something that will make your McLaren and your Porsche look like Lumps of yes. Oh, will you now? Will you? Give me the fizz. Come on, Ferrari. Oh, it definitely sounds the best. I don't care. You can disagree or you like. Wait, you... <laughs> You've actually got to generate the fizz. That's the objective. I've got to get five fizzes. The noises definitely sound like fizz. I'm not exactly sure that I should be attempting to generate any type of fizz in a lone Ferrari, but hey... Well, I'll do my best. My objective is to produce fizz. I can't get over this. This is amazing. I've got to make a man very excited. That's the object. It's insane. Like, <laughs> I was expecting a kind of basics game. Not really much to it. But they've made it fun. They've, they've used what they have and made it stupid. Exactly what the Grand Tour is meant to be. And I love that. Fizz generated. We got the golden fizz. I am the man that can help James May generate the man juices. This, I believe, will absolutely the other I'm pretty sure it will. The Trinity. Oh, yes. The game. We're actually going to have a race now. Oh, we get to choose who we want. The P1. On oh, the left or right. P1. P1. Hey, that's not fair. I wasn't accelerating. I wasn't ready. We're, so now we've got the power ups, and this is where the split screen would jump into play, obviously. What is that? Million pound race. It's a bit more than a million, but it's a few million pounds. Candy fog. Wait, the power ups are a bit silly. I've got to be. I've got to be honest. But that was the A. They needed to add something than just it having racing. I think to to fit the kids, and the kids like the candy fog. We'll see. More horsepowers. We got boots! Oh, if we crash, we lose it. The car hates you, and who can blame it? Wait, that was Hammond texting me. That was that was what the texting power of. That's stupid. It's exhausting watching you try to drive. Mate! How have I slowed down that much? I wouldn't read this. It doesn't mean I need to read the text. Oh, come on! That's not fair! <laughs> right at the end, the P1 has been destroyed by Hammond texting. We got the boost! I've got to hold it. Come on! It's okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm, I'm, I'll accept my defeat. Let's make the first test a drag race using electrical power only. Do we actually get to do this event? Oh my god, we're doing it. We're doing an eco race. <laughs> you know what? Three, two. Keep it in the green. Go. I don't think I was. I think I was supposed to actually do well there. I just hold two. it. And we're off. Oh, yes. Electric power! And we're going to cross the line ahead. Oh, the 918 German powers! Oh, yes! <laughs> that was how it's supposed to go. Like, come on. But it's not important, though, is it? Is it not? No, it's not. <laughs> right, right. We've got to drive That's to the hotel, yeah? Yeah. It's about an hour away. And it gives us a chance to see what they're like on the road. That's a good point. Real world. That it's a race at the hotel. Point. I can't do that. I can't. Well, I can't drive the Ferrari on the what? road. What? Oi. Well, it's not oh, registered. yeah. It is. It's got number plates. No, no, no. Just, that's just pretend number plates. If they register it, it becomes second hand and they have to pay the tax. That's why it came in a lorry. Oh, no. Mate, that's. Oh, oh that's. <laughs> the road to the hotel. Do I get to choose which car I want on this one? Or do I have to drive the 918? To be fair, I've been driving the P1 for a little bit. Do I actually get to drive for an hour to the hotel? 
I don't think I do. <laughs> More than 10% through the event. We only just got started. But hey, I can act. You know, I was complaining about the drifting. Like, yeah, it's, it's, it's not great. But I do get to use my. I don't have to drift. That's the nice thing. I can just. I can, I can drive and brake. And I can take the turn. It's amazing. P1, go away! I know you, you're the better car, and it's what I would go for, but... No. Listen! Stop it! Oh my god, I died. Uh, I'm about 400 meters behind. And I think the race is basically over. Uh... <laughs> I got a toilet because I lost completely. Now we've got access to the track, which I think the BMW M2 was one of the first cars to drive around it, so. Or this. Okay, maybe I'm not driving an M2. <laughs> this is the first game to have the new Grand Tour test track in it. It's, it's brilliant. And it, oh, oh God! I wasn't expecting that. This course is actually... It's not going great for me. Is it? Oh, yeah, I remember the actual sheep as well. Oh, now it's the M2. I remember seeing it in the trailer. That's why I thought we jumped right in. I love the transitions. The transitions are done really, really well. So, again, uh, this explains exactly what the Grand Tour game is. It is literally us playing the Grand Tour as it pretty much explained. Uh, the physics are definitely on the arcade side. It's definitely... A game that you can play through quite quickly. I imagine I'm pretty much halfway through season one. As I said, it's kind of like the beginnings. The beginnings of what could be something absolutely major in the future. A Grand Tour exploration game where you could play with your friends online and... I don't know. The Grand Tour. It just has a ring to it, you know? And this corner is quite sharp. My brakes are apparently better than I thought. It is a drift contest. I just focus on me drifting, and I've only just got the silver one, and I think I'm right at the end, which is absolutely fantastic. There's no way that I'm going to earn enough. <laughs> yeah, I've, <laughs> I've, I've cocked this one up on sight. We're we driving as the American now. Utterly bewildered. I think we're doing the exact same thing, but we're doing a time trial this time. So there's going to be a lot of reuses of things, but I'm now driving as the American. Can I see the American? Actually, am I? Is that the? It, it might be. It reminds me of one of those classic racing games where it gave you pretty much what you got. There's not, there's not much else left to. You get what you're given, kind of thing. Oh, that was much better. Can we keep the drift going? Oh, we don't need to. It gripped up. Can he get the gold? Come on, focus, 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 focus. Oh, just the silver. We're about to again do something with the three cars, which. It's a, a, war of the, a war of the revs. But now I wanted to check something real quick. If you pause the game, if I go to settings, actually, what control settings do we have? Can we actually change anything? No, I don't believe so. But we have a drift, use gadgets, accelerate, brake, and that's it. Uh, game settings, we have units, miles per hour, vibration on. I was just wondering if there's any, like, uh, extra settings to kind of improve the, the 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 simulation feel on it, but I also wanted to see watch episodes. If I click watch episode, is it genuinely gonna put me on the Amazon app? I think yes. It's meant to, it's looking for the for the Amazon app, which I don't have installed because I watch it on my telly downstairs. There we go, the Grand Tour game. An interesting concept. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Are you interested? Are you excited? Are you intrigued? Do you want to give it a go? Well, if so. Whoopam! Here's some codes for you. Remember, if you want to join in the giveaways on my Twitter down below, give a comment, any random comment, and don't beg for a code, or I probably won't pick you. <laughs> comment something constructive and interesting. And uh, other than that, let me know if you want to see more of it. Smash like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.